Alright, this game is another lesson in not giving up, thinking outside the box, and helping your ally. So, I'm the Terran in this game. We have good Zerg players on the top, we have Kleinsman on the bottom, we have Hector. These are both good players, Hector's particularly a good Terran. And I have for allies, let's see, I have left, right, I don't know him very well, and I've got Rakshin. Rakshin's really good. I believe I had the highest score in this game, so I only took two gas and immediately started walling off, thinking that I would get focused. We're about to see that I was mistaken, because Kleinsman chooses to focus on Rakshin. So Rakshin is prepared. He's trying to hold. I realize my mistake almost immediately. So if we speed things up, I try to rectify it by going to take I'll this gas up here. And I send a Reaper up there to protect it. It is only 1 minute 35 seconds. So I have... I mean, at this point in time, I have one Reaper. That's all I can have. I probably have a shock around here somewhere. I don't see it. But Raction is already getting focused. It looks like he's got Creepers. Let's look at uh, Kleinsman's vision. So, he hasn't built anything on him. But he's taken... He's built on me, but he's taken the supply and sent it all towards him. So, I don't want to give up. I don't want to just let my ally die. But I only have one Reaper. What can I possibly do? So... Let's switch to my camera and let's see what I can do. Okay, so we'll cut that. Let's just follow and see what happens. Our allies are being attacked. <clears throat> Our allies are being attacked. Here we go, here I go. One Reaper. There we go, look at that. Meanwhile, I built my shock. It looks like I went Reaper first, so I had the Reaper before the shock. So, I bring him over. There we go, take care of business. Now we have three Reapers. Let's go do it again. We gotta help our ally out. And we can do so, even with a small army. There we go. is under attack. Our allies are being attacked. There we go. So we see how weak Terrans complain that Zerg is OP and they demand more opportunity be created for them without any effort on their own part. Strong Terrans create opportunity where none existed. I believe we do in the end win this game. I could be wrong, but even if we lose, Rakshin was able to hold some territory, and I think if we fast forward, he, you know, he takes all his gas, and we have a great game, whether we win or lose. So, that's the moral of the story.